have Stephanie Arney from Mutual of Omaha's Wild Kingdom in here. What she brought that? some animals for us. What, what's next, Stephanie? I what is making that noise? I can't explain how my insides is, feel. What in the heck? You like shake. Like, I don't have That's a bird. I have some sort of That's, weird animal feel. Bird, I just bird. want a white oh. opossum. It's like a falcon or something. Oh, it's, oh, it's an, an owl. owl. It's an owl. <laughs> it's an owl. It's a big uh, owl. Hello. <laughs> oh, it's a big owl. <laughs> Oh, so he's not this? that's funny. Oh, yeah, Look man, at his bro, face. Bro, 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 Al is whoa. giving Big Al the death stare. Yeah, I got to take a picture with the Big Al. We have some Big Al on now crime. So this <laughs> is a Eurasian eagle owl, but they're found all over Europe and Asia and down Ooh. into Africa. He's his name a- is Kruger. And this is kind of uncommon. Not many people get to touch an owl. A lot of the time, yeah. birds of prey touch are not really like the cuddly types of birds, like yeah. a cockatiel or cockatoo. Yeah. Um, and quite, to be honest with you, they're a bit intimidating, aren't they? Yeah, yeah. I don't, I don't oh, I'm yeah. scared. You know, I'm even kind of like, oh, you're cool right there. <laughs> um, but how, how does the, the bird feel, Jenna? <laughs> The softest feathers. Yeah, the owls, they are very different than other birds because they have silent feathers. And that's what gives them the ability to, when they're hunting, they'll swoop down Mm -hmm. and the mice or rats or whatever they're hunting don't even hear them. And there's these cool TED videos or TED or YouTube videos, I'm not sure, of they're measuring the beats and like have amazing audio equipment to try to hear them compared to hawks. Nothing. Even like these microphones and stuff cannot pick up their sound. Well, this guy's not very quiet. Well, well, ex- like <laughs> excellent point. Can I talk to him real quick? <laughs> He's squealing. He's- Why are you good at every <laughs> animal? You can't do anything with owls, though, <laughs> because you're, <laughs> you're behind their back and they just flip their head around like what? <laughs> all the way. Yeah, they well, this can't is going to walk around and let you guys all get a closer look. So <laughs> this owl is is the largest of out. the owl species in the world. <laughs> And a lot of people think that owls can turn their heads all the way around, but they cannot. Almost. It's right. almost. It's 180 okay. degrees both directions. And surprisingly, a lot of other birds can do that. But people just think of only owls. And I think it's because they're, they have a flat face, so it's really obvious when they turn their neck around. And the reason for that is because their eyeballs are fixed uh-huh. in their heads. So unlike us, they can't move their eyes. we can keep our heads straight and we can look around, right? So, oh I thought God. it pooped okay. on you. <laughs> Listen, those birds can sense fear. Stop it. They can. They can sense it. You oh, need to stop so that soft, fear. Stephanie. I know. They Very are soft. Those so, feathers are how unbelievable. How far away can they see? Okay, so if you're an owl and you're nocturnal, which is already impressive that they can see at night, yeah. if they were on a goal post and there was a little tiny mouse, like a field mouse, at the 50-yard line, mm-hmm. yeah. then they would be able to see it perfectly in the dark. Mm. Wow. That blows my mind. Our yeah. eyes are so crappy compared to their eyes. And if you look at their eyeballs, like I said, they're fixing their head so they can't turn around, which is why they have to be able to move their head like that. But it almost reminds you of this camera right here. Every time they have light coming in, they can adjust their pupils. Like, yeah, see is that, that like the aperture? Am I saying that right? It's like the aperture in their Look eyeball. Sure. What is I don't know much about cameras. What is he communicating right now? He's hungry or ah. stressed or what? Oh, Alyssa, what, why is this owl He's very um, vocal? to their parents mm-hmm. when they're saying, hey, I want to get some food. And so yeah, he, and you're treating him. He's 19 years old. Hello. So he's, Ni- he's 19 years old? Anymore, Hello. But since he was raised with people, that's kind of his way of saying, like, okay, guys. You, did you say he's 19 years old? He's 19 now. He Ali's too young, too young for you, Al. Wow. <laughs> almost, he can almost drink at the bar. So he's a sophomore in college, right? Yeah. Now. Like, hey, see, so. now that would have been a good plug for your bar. Right. See, those, ah, you got to think of those things. See, Mutual of Omaha has trained me well. Too. Thank you, Mutual. <laughs> thing, like, he's how looking at he, life insurance now. Is it like how old is he in bird years? Or is it like dog years? Like no. No, it's just it's legit 19. years. It's legit how 19. How long does he live? Maybe. What, 30? Out in the wild, they'll live about 20 years. 20? Yeah. Okay. okay so we good. got him a little while longer. By the way, Kruger's eyebrows are on fleek. Yeah. If I may say so myself. Oh my. Oh. Okay. Are you talking about like the tufts? Yeah. 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 Okay. So a lot of people see out there's a great horned owl. They have those big tufts, and they think it's because of like little horns, or if it's their eyebrows. Mm-hmm. It's actually tufts that number one they can raise up to look alarm, but also they collect the sound, and they have two ear wow. holes like you and I do, but they don't have these little flappy things. Yeah. They just have holes. And they're underneath the feathers, and they're uh, they're off. They're not perfectly symmetrical like ours are. They're off, and that's so that they just have better hearing in all okay. different directions. Oh. Cool. You have, have you ever uh, kind of look like Jack Nicholson when his eyebrows are? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yes. see, that's the next name for your, your uh, an, a next owl is Jack Nicholson. How does owl meat taste? Do you want to have him fly across the studio? Oh, no. Yes. Oh, to you. I've actually. 
You're surprising me. They didn't tell me they were going to do this. Girl. Okay. Hold on. Let me get video. Oh, no. Which way? Okay. Hey. I'm going to come stand over here. Oh, my goodness. Video. I know. We always want your own. Do we have to be quiet or anything? No. Okay. Owl flying. The most talented out <gasps> in the studio. Whoa. Okay. Whoa. So is there any way we can do that again and see if we can like, not hear? Okay, yeah. Everybody, I don't know. Can I put my... Everybody be very, very quiet. Here we go. I'm going to put my microphone by his wings. Oh, here I go. Everybody be quiet. Here we go. Can't hear you it. cannot hear a thing. Okay, what you heard was too nothing. from that was um, the the wind hitting your yeah. sign. Yeah. No. Yeah. Otherwise, you just you can't hear it. How cool is that? And okay, Very. so they're, they are meat eaters. So right now, what are you feeding them? Probably baby mice, <laughs> baby chunk of meat. Uh, okay. Oh, but I nice. Know, it's good I didn't Yum. bring my pug to work today. Don't bring your pug to work when we have animals. <laughs> Extra rare, huh?